Hello students, a very good morning to all. Welcome back to Catalyst Chemistry classes. So today, we will discuss the topic. It is called uh, mass bar spectroscopy. Okay, the mass bar spectroscopy, it is one of the very most important topic. Okay, according to your CSCR, GATE and PGTRB point of view. Okay, so this is the first video from this mass bar spectroscopy technique. Okay, so in the classes, we will discuss the mass bar spectroscopy. What is the principle? Uh, for mass bar spectroscopy and uh, other applications and other put them discuss proper first to see here mb which means mass bar spectroscopy okay the mass bar spectroscopy is also known as nuclear gamma resonance spectroscopy okay so nuclear gamma resonance spectroscopy it is another name for mass bar spectroscopy yeah when the nuclear gamma resonance spectroscopy of dinner of dinner it is a gamma ray okay gamma rays are used to to Transition carry out. Okay, so in the transition at the main rays are good enough dinner gamma rays. Okay, so in the spectroscopy, first of all, uh, the technique used for our Abdina Rudolf Mosbar Abdin Ravada is the first of all on the Kondo and he got a Nobel Prize. Okay, you are a physics scientist and he got a Nobel Prize for this technique. Okay, it involves a nuclear transition resulting from the absorption of gamma ray by the sample okay so source in the varakudiya gamma rays sample absorb on both they involve in the transition okay so number to analyze one of the other sample on the another of dinner gamma ray absorb on the and the absorb on the and the gamma ray that transitionally involve the okay and the transition at a girl another number can agree the plot on the other graph on the number to take okay from this graph we can get the information about the unknown sample and it measures the spectrum of energies at which the specific nuclei absorb gamma rays okay then it is used to study nuclear structure with the absorption or re-emission of gamma rays okay it is used to study the structure okay nuclear structure study pantaga is out next day we are going to discuss about the principle okay so before going to start the principle mass bar spectroscopy vandu work avuna rendu effect base pannudhu okay one is called recoil effect or recoil energy appdin solluvom second one is called doppler shift okay indha rendum base panni da mass bar spectroscopy vandu function aagudhu okay so first na principle discuss panniren after that i'm going to discuss about what is a recoil effect or recoil energy and doppler shift okay so first principle paathinga appdina it involves um, involves the recoil less okay emission of gamma rays by the radioactive nuclei okay so first in upon over a radioactive nuclear okay so on the radioactive nuclei it emits some amount of gamma rays okay so on the gamma rays are further on the sample point of looking at the transition line wall okay so for first in a little source I did not know a radioactive element circle no okay and next we are going to discuss about conditions so principles but on it rather other the principle in a solo the body now radioactive nuclei are you gonna be in there this also comes under the principle down but is in a condition now look at the camp okay well so conditions but you know first to find where the atoms in source emitting gamma rays must be of same isotopes as the atoms present in the sample absorbing them okay so I'll be in a solar on the body now Source will run the video today. I will explain. Okay, well, so you don't explain but I'm but you don't try to understand it. Okay, or source will run the some electron capture Muloma. Okay, initially at the good year and the radioactive nuclei. It's converted into another one. Okay, if for example, a up in one need to grow up in a in the electron capture key in all of the wait. Okay, see here. Yeah, up in row and I'm ready to grow. Okay, it involves the electron capture and then it converted into B. Okay, so if the B is converted to the B, the B is the next it involves in the, it emits the gamma rays. Okay, in the B is the gamma ray is emitted. Okay, so if we say that, if we have an unknown sample, in the unknown sample, in the B is the compound. That's what we say. So 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 that's what we say. For example, in the middle, we have cobalt. When cobalt undergoes electron capture, it is converted into iron. Okay, iron is converted. Now, if the iron is not there, further gamma ray will be released. Okay, so we have to take a sample. It is an iron-containing sample. Okay, so that is what I am saying. The atoms in source emitting gamma rays must be the same isotopes 
okay as the atoms present in the sample absorbing them this is the first condition and second condition the energy of gamma radiations should be in the range of 10 to 200 kilo electron volt la irukano okay next the mass bar effect cannot be absorbed in liquid and gases because the recoil energy cannot be uh, dissipated in these states of matter next condition this is very important okay so the nucleus under consideration should have i value is greater than zero i in the it is a nucleus spin okay already we have the nmrs discuss the nucleus spin over at the calculation under the path okay so on the i order value is always greater than zero also should have different i values in ground state and the excited state okay so ground state liyo, excited state liyo, i order value the different i no? okay so these are the conditions okay so first parang atoms children the other source la gamma ray wave value of the other um, nucleum other i other isotopes and also sample present isotopes same i no? second one the gamma radi radiation range on the other 10 to 200 kilo electron volt no? third one the other one it is not applicable for liquid and gases and it is only applicable for solid substance okay and fourth condition it's a uh, spin value the nucleus spin value is always greater than zero and the nucleus spin value on the ground state ko excited state ko different type you know? okay so these are the conditions for mass bar spectroscopy okay now see the basic principles okay so x and the radioactive nucleus first number it is the okay so it is a atomic number and this one is mass number when they are undergo electron capture okay electron capture in the mode or electron in our reduce out okay so the electron reduce on both it is atomic number also reduce okay so now the x is converted into y by involving electron capture okay so the electron is captured from the k shell okay so other than you could again for example now i'm going to take a cobalt 57 okay its atomic number is 27 mass number it is radioactive nuclear when it is involved in the electron capture okay so on the electron reduce ago so it converted into radio radioactive fe okay fe a convert other and this is the excitation state of iron okay it is on the not a ground state it is the excited state of uh, iron okay so come to here this is the excited state of iron if iron enna pannudha appadina idoda excited state la irundhu again enna varudhu ground state ku varudhu ipdi ground state ku varumbodhu is absorb panna and or energy ah veliyidudhu radiation ah veliyidhu and the radiation la enna solranga appadina gamma radiation okay in the gamma radiation ah yaar vaangikira appadina sample inga pathinga appadina in the sample yo iron 57 ra or component irukku ipo in the sample enna pannudha appadina in the gamma radiation ah absorb pannite excited state ku pogudhu okay so if we go to excitation we will see what we have in the detector la. okay so detector we will see a graph kadakam. okay from this one we can find out the character of the sample okay so if we look at this one see here iron is excited state and iron is converted into the ground state this is what we say it is a gamma ray fluorescence we say directly from the excited state and iron is in the ground state this is what we say source nucleus we say okay up to this is called a source nucleus and it emit panna kudiye in the gamma radiation vandu inga poi involve avum and it involves in the again excitation in the energy absorb pannite excitation podu this is called a sample nucleus inga irukadhu kudiye in the fe indrathu sample la irukka kudiye nucleus in the fe indrathu source la irundha namalukku nucleus idu okay so gamma ray resonance this is called a gamma ray fluorescence and this is called a gamma ray resonance see here yeah, i will explain in clearly Okay, so first of all, we are going to take a cobalt 57. Okay, cobalt 57 it is a radioactive element. Okay, it is a radioactive nuclear. Okay, so this is a T of half life time. It is a 270 days. Okay, it is a T half, half life. Okay, now it involves in the electron capture. Okay. It involves in the electron capture. Due to the electron capture, the cobalt, okay, electron capture, okay, the cobalt now is converted into iron. Okay, iron 57 are converted. And iron 57, it is a excited, excited state of iron. 
ओके सो इन एक्सटेड स्टेट पाती अब एक्सटेड स्टेट अयनोड ई वैल्यूस पाती अब इट इस ई वैल्यू ईक्वल टू थ्री बै टू ओके एक्सटेड स्टेट अयनोड वैल्यू थ्री बै टू आके नाउ इो एक्सटेड स्टेट अयन वर्दा ग्रउंड स्टेट के अगेन ऋटन आगे ओके दिस इज ग्रउंड स्टेट आफ अयर एफ ओके सो इत ग्रउंड स्टेट ईयो वैल्यू पाती अब ई वैल्यू ईक्वल टू वन बै टू हाफ ओके सो इन इप्ली वो इट रिली सम अमौंट आफ गामा रे ओके इट रिली द गामा रे गामा रेवो रेज पाती अब एव्व अब इट इस फोर्टीन पॉइंट फोर फोर्टीन पॉइंट फोर किलो एलक्ट्रॉन वोल्ट नम आल गामा रेज एव्व कंडीशन पातम टेन टू टू हंड्रेड ओके अंदर रेंज को लेकर पातम इं वो फोर्टीन पॉइंट फोर किलो एलक्ट्रॉन वोल्ट नौ इत गाम यार अब्सर्व पड़ा अब सांपल कैन अब्सर्व दिस गामा रे ओके द सैंपल कैन अब्सर्व द गामा रे एंड ड्यू टू दिस एक्सटेशन हेपन ओके ग्रउंड स्टेटर इत वो सांपल अयरन सो इट अंडर गो एक्सटेशन फ्रम ग्रउंड स्टेट हयर एनर्जी स्टेट को गामा रेव अब्सर्व पड़ा सो द एनर्जी डिफ्रेंस बिटवी सोर्स इत वो सोर्स अंड दिस वन इज सांपल ओके एनर्जी डिफ्रेंस रेनर्जी डिफ्रेंस रेनर्जी स्टेट ऐसा इत ग्रउंड स्टेट अंड दिस इज एक्सटेड स्टेट ओके एनर्जी डिफ्रेंस बिटवी सोर्स अंड सांपल इट्स नाट आलवे सेंपये वो सेंमका अदकान रीसन अब ईसोमर शिफ्ट अब ईसोमर शिफ्ट ईसोमर शिफ्ट अब सो इत सांपलकू अयनो एनवेमेंट वो डिफ्रंटा ओके समटम दे आर टेट्रा हिटल अंड समटम दे आर इन आक्टा हिटल ओके केमिकली एनवेमेंट इज नाट सेम दैट्स वै इो एनर्जी लेवल चेंजस् वो वो ओके नौ इत वो ये और कनेक्टा और डिटेक्टा कूड़ा कनेक्टा दिस डिटेक्टर इट कन प्लाट द ग्राफ ओके ग्राफ वो नम्बर प्लाट आ सो दिस इज प्रा इनवाल इन द मार स्पेक्ट्रोस्कोपी सो अब वेन कोबाल ओके इट्स ए रेडियो आक्टिव न्यूक्लियो ड्यू टू द एलक्ट्रॉन कैप्चर इट इस कन्वर्टड इन टू अयन ओके अयन फिफ्टी सेवन कन्वेट आगे बट इट इस एक्सटेड स्टेट आफ अयर ओके इट कैप्चर द एलक्ट्रॉन को अंड आलसो द एलक्ट्रॉन एड़ा के ओके सो द एक्सटेड आफ अयन वह पाती अब स्पिन वैल्यू वो थ्री बै टू ई वैल्यू अदे वो ग्रउंड स्टेट वन बै टू अब ओके नेक्स्ट द एमटड वैल्यू ओके द एमटड गामा रेवो वैल्यू वो फोर्टीन पॉइंट फोर किलो एलक्ट्रॉन वोल्ट द सोर्स एमटेड बै द गामा रे इज अब्स बै द सांपल ओके सोर्स मूलम एमट आगे और गामा रेवे यार अब्सर्व पड़ा इत सांपल वो अब्सर्व पड़े ओके ड्यू टू द ईसोमरी शिफ्ट विच मीन द एलक्ट्रा द एनवेमेंटल ओके केमिकल एनवेमेंटल डिफ्रंटाक अब रेनर्जी लेवलों सेम कूल नम्बर क्या वि गेट प्लाट ओके दिसिक प्रसिपल अब मार स्पेक्ट्रोस्कोपी ओके ना आलरे रे टू शिफ्ट उन्होंने डॉप्लर शिफ्ट अंड इन रीकोल एनर्जी ऐ विल डिस्क अंदर ना नेक्स्ट क्लास डिस्क पड़े थैंक यू सो मच